all day, baby. <gasps> Do you have a minute? For you? I have all the time in the world. Oh, um, I'm looking for a scientist. A scientist? Well, I know as well as any that science has brought many modern miracles to our world. But it's foolish to expect science to solve the problems in your life, the problems in your psyche. What? No, my psyche is fine. Sentinel was searching for a scientist, and I just wanted to see what was going on. Hmm. I do treat many scientists. In fact, maybe three of my patients might be willing to talk to you. But I can't guarantee they'll all be cooperative. Perhaps one of them is the person you're looking for. What do they look like? I'll tell you what I told them. I focus on what my patients' minds look like, rather than distracting myself with their rather trivial physical appearances. You have no idea what your patients look like? Right off the bat, I'd say we could start digging into the root of your anger issues. Great, you've been very helpful. I know my patients by their inner demons. If you were to say, I'm looking for somebody suffering from clinical nanoanthropy, object sexuality disorder, or Gelos syndrome, then I could tell you exactly who it is. I'll come back if I have any more questions. Well, this first consultation was free. But for a full session, you'll need to book an appointment. Let's see, I'm free Wednesday at 1.30. Hey there. Greetings and salutations, human. How may I be of service today? What are you, some kind of robot? Thank you for your query. We are not a robot. We prefer artificial life forms. We are a unit of nanobots working in unison to simulate human life and biological functionality. Okay, well, that's new. Um, sorry, look, maybe you can help me. I'm looking for information about a missing scientist. I was told you might know something. Thank you for your query, human. Our protocols do not allow us to convey that classified security information. Have a nice day. Uh, you too. What is it? <gasps> Hi, stranger. Uh, who? Hello. You didn't happen to bring one of those Sentinel drones with you, did you? No. Look, I'm looking for a missing scientist. They were a patient here. I was hoping you could help me. Have you ever really looked at a drone? Focused on its parts? The sexy, sleek lines that run down its body? Ever look at it and think, this thing, it knows my soul? I can't say that I have. I don't think of machines that way. You should. They're more than just machines. They are the world's greatest sex toy. They make me hot and bothered. Uh, can we just focus on the issue at hand, please? Have you heard anything at all? Oh. You know, now that you mention it, there's a scientist that worked as the head of the Scale Security Office. Maybe you talk to them? Thanks for the help. Anytime. And if you happen to see one of those drones nearby, be sure to tell them that Mortimer is thinking about them. I'll be sure to do that, Morty. Please, leave me alone. I don't want trouble. Please. What do you want? Oh. Hey, this... You can't be here. What are you doing here? Hey there. How are you feeling today? Pretty sad. But at least I'm free. Here, free of being that creature. Oh my God. It's nice. Creature? Well, they call it a creature, but I call it a god. Gilas, the divine personification of laughter. When I get too excited, 
I infect others with my maniacal laughter. It's like a venereal disease, a hysterical virus. So they have you on tranquilizers? Something like that. Here I can have a life free of humor, jokes, and other funny things. I need to take life seriously, they tell me. Okay then, um, seriously? I need your help. I'm looking for a scientist that happened to go missing. Nobody's seen him for a while. There's a scientist by my house. We're actually neighbors. They're always out and about. Sort of fits your description. I'm not joking. Know where I can find them? Yes. There are apartments over by the Vega residences. It's silly simple to find. Thank you. I hope you're cured of this nonsense soon. What's left for them to do? Remove my funny bone? <laughs> <laughs> what? Hi, don't be be afraid. How are you feeling today? Pretty sad. But at least I'm free here. Free of being that creature. It's nice. Creature? Well, they call it a creature, but I call it a god. Gilas. The divine personification of laughter. When I get too excited, I infect others with my maniacal laughter. It's like a venereal disease, a hysterical virus. So they have you on tranquilizers? Something like that. Here I can have a life free of humor, jokes, and other funny things. I need to take life seriously, they tell me. Okay then, um... Seriously? I need your help. I'm looking for a scientist that happened to go missing. Nobody's seen him for a while. There's a scientist by my house. We're actually neighbors. They're always out and about. Sort of fits your description. I'm not joking. Know where I can find them? Yes. There are apartments over by the Vega residences. It's silly simple to find. Thank you. I hope you're cured of this nonsense soon. What's left for them to do? Remove my funny bone? <laughs> what are you doing here? Okay, okay, okay. Like a whisper over here. Hey, what is it?
the drone overhead. Spotted one there. Reacher on the objective. What is this?
Be advised, hostiles are on alert. Heads up, that guy over there. No! HPG, mission break for him! Spotted one, there. Alright, on the move! <gasps> Someone's Keep here! Looking. I'm gonna flush They're him out! out here. Eyes on it! I'll take the better than the tech nomad! That's the stuff! Let no rip! Okay, we're clear. 
Are you the scientist the soldiers are looking for? Scientist? Me? <laughs> no. No, I'm just a humble groundskeeper. Can't play golf if there's too many divots. It's okay. I'm not here to hurt you. Hurt me? Why would you hurt me? Uh, I can help you get the best tea time on the island. Seriously, I'm not with Sentinel. You can drop the act. Really? Oh, thank Gaia. Why are you on the run? I was working on new surveillance tech. That would make sure that no one could do anything naughty without being caught. But now the soldiers want to use it on the homesteaders and outcasts to control them. If the people ensuring everyone acts nice are the ones that are naughty, then the whole thing goes backwards. Right. So I had no choice. I did the worst thing ever in the history of the world that I could ever do. Killed your supervisor and ran off. Killed? No. Much worse. I erased my work and ran off. That's worse. People are born all the time, but my work... My work... The world may never see its like again. What can I do to help? Well, I need to be dead. Come on, I'm not gonna kill you, man. No, no, not for real dead. Pretend dead. If you can hack the servers at Black Tiger Outpost and change my data without anyone noticing, then it will look like I died trying to escape them. Okay, I'll see what I can do. Hey, I'm gonna be dead.
visual on a rocket gunner. Nice. <laughs> I see a preacher. All day, baby. Who's this? Oh. We got hostiles in here. Oh. Lead. Maneuvering in position. Roger. Moving to the target. Got the wolf boss. Got the wolf boss. Clear.
What? What is it? Okay, I took care of your death. I'm dead? I'm dead. Yes! Finally dead! Just keep your head down for a while, all right? Oh, don't worry. They would need my old tech to find me, but they can't use that. Because I deleted it. Yep, I got it. I'll make something new. Something so good that no bad people could ever use it for something bad. Sounds great. Oh, yeah, one more thing. What? Please get a new psychologist.